I believe Optimus will ultimately prove to be the most valuable asset and has a strong potential to become the most valuable product ever developed. Exceptional large-scale manufacturing is essential to keep the robot's cost affordable, targeting $10,000 to $20,000 rather than hundreds of thousands. Imagine the world's most valuable product being a $10,000 robot. Elon Musk recently announced that Tesla's Optimus, a humanoid robot capable of walking, working, and learning independently, could be priced as low as $10,000 by 2026, less than many iPhones over a few years. Beyond its affordability, Optimus has proven it can operate autonomously in challenging environments like disaster zones and epidemic areas, and it will play a critical role in producing millions of cybercabs at Giga Texas. What advancements enable this? Can a $10,000 robot truly handle tasks from household chores to factory operations and high-risk rescue missions? Welcome to Auto Intel. What can the Tesla Bot Gen 3 do, and where does it fall short? You've seen the polished demos, Optimus gliding across factory floors, folding shirts, catching tennis balls with ease. Impressive, but will it solve real problems? Gen 3 aims to turn uncertainty into confidence by addressing practical challenges. Mobility is a key focus, particularly the staircase problem. For anyone who's struggled with a laundry basket on steep stairs, Optimus' hesitation on descents is a concern. Gen 2 reaches 5 km per hour on flat ground and can clear a curb but struggles with downward slopes. Gen 3 redesigns the ankle structure, adds a descent control system, and processes inertial measurement data every 4 milliseconds for predictive balance. By Q3 2025, this update will ensure smooth navigation, eliminating fears of a 200-pound robot stuck upstairs. Safety is another priority. Imagine a robot handling a knife near a loved one. Current hands, with 11 degrees of freedom and 5 newton force sensing, can lift boxes but miss subtle cues like a wet tomato slip. Gen 3 doubles the joints, triples tactile precision, and adds temperature and collision detection. This builds trust, ensuring the robot can handle delicate tasks like washing lettuce without risk. For elder care, Tesla's timeline, pilots in 2026, commercial units in 2027, reflects a focus on reliability. The robot must navigate slick tiles, detect falls instantly, and call for help to prevent injuries. Gen 3's IP54 rating protects against steam and soap, while its fall detection analyzes micro-accelerations in 200 milliseconds to respond appropriately. This addresses the critical need for constant caregiving that a single person can't provide. Priced at $15,000 to $20,000, Optimus is a significant investment. Tesla offers a $499 monthly lease, including service, and a $1,200 battery swap every four years. However, supply chain risks, like rare earth export restrictions, could raise costs. Gen 3 mitigates this with North American sourced ferrite magnets, stabilizing prices and simplifying logistics. Security concerns, such as hacking, are addressed with a trusted platform module that blocks unauthorized updates. Sentry mode locks joints, emits an 80 decibel alarm, and streams GPS if theft is attempted. The aluminum frame acts as a Faraday cage against electromagnetic pulses, though it's not battlefield proof. These measures have prompted insurers to consider a $20 monthly rider. Rural environments pose challenges like dust, rain, and extreme cold. Gen 3's IP54 skin handles light moisture, and its self-heating pack operates at minus 10 degrees Celsius. A 2027 terrain kit adds rugged boots for muddy conditions. Service in remote areas is improved with bi-monthly van visits and Starlink-enabled remote diagnostics, a step up from limited technician access. Analysts predict humanoids will eliminate 5% of repetitive jobs while creating millions of new roles. Tesla's retraining for displaced workers is pragmatic, as Gen 3's ability to stack crates and thread wire harnesses shifts jobs toward supervision. Why is Gen 3 unique? It delivers real-world utility at scale. Unlike clunky prototypes, Optimus is trained, not programmed, using Tesla's expertise in motors, batteries, and AI from its vehicles. 
this enables faster development and lower costs. Optimus handles tasks like inspecting packages, serving drinks, folding clothes, charging EVs, cleaning kitchens, watering plants, carrying loads, playing games, dancing, and answering questions. In 2024 demos, it showed environmental awareness, not just scripted actions. Tesla plans to produce 5,000 units in 2025, scaling to 50,000 in 2026, starting in factories like the Cyber Cab Line, where it could replace two to three workers per task. This supports hyper-fast production, with cars potentially built in under five seconds. Competitors like NEO use robots, but Tesla's integrated AI and production systems provide an edge. Gen 3 learns by observing videos, practicing tasks like cooking or folding clothes until proficient. This deep learning, inspired by human trial and error, eliminates traditional coding for new tasks. Initial training via teleoperation refines its skills over time, though issues like misinterpreting speech or navigating complex terrain persist. Software updates and self-correction, like reorganizing a dropped battery tray, showcase its adaptability. Optimus significance lies in its accessibility. Elon Musk predicts it will surpass all Tesla vehicles in revenue, not as a high-cost prototype but as a $10,000 to $20,000 household robot. This could transform daily life, from home assistance to factory and disaster zone work. Building it affordably leverages Tesla's vehicle components, with Gen 3's 4,680 battery reducing weight by 22 pounds for better efficiency. If Optimus hits $10,000 in 2026, would you buy one immediately or wait for real-world testing? Share your thoughts in the comments. Thank you for watching. For more on Tesla EVs and Optimus, like and share this video. Subscribe to Auto Intel and enable notifications for our latest updates. We value your support and look forward to your next visit. Goodbye.